and welcome to the sale of our Toyota Ram 4. This is an XT D4D uh, 4x4 5 door in blue. Um, to be fair, it's not a bad car. It does need a couple of hundred quid's worth of paint, but we'll touch on that as I walk around. Uh, two owners, ten stamps in the book, so you know a lot, a lot of stamps are there. Could do a full modern polish. Um, also, as is the metallic blue. But as I said, we'll touch on every panel as we go around. Uh, to be fair. The rear quarter panel is all very good. You got a local dent, your local dent man repair just there. Um, plastics, to be fair, it's all good. I mean, it's a little, little, little nick there. So um, I don't know whether you do that again. It's in 101,000 miles, but other than that, that's all good on there. The alloy, a little bit of corrosion, but that's quite standard on these. And the tyre is on six mil. Passenger door, rear, to be fair, all oh, good. I mean, there's nothing you can spend money on on there, really. Just needs a good old-fashioned mop and polish, um, and so does the front door. But nothing you realistically going to spend money on. It's also got the side steps, all good. Um, this is where you would need to paint. Sadly, it's got a key mark just down there, so that's one panel you're going to paint. Front tyres are basically like brand new. Again, the alloys are in very good condition, but again, some light corrosion on the alloy. Front bonnet, bar a couple of stone chips, all good. Tax will be left on there, so the tax is on it till April. And the front bumper, again, modern polish, but you know, a couple of stone chips. But you're going to need to touch in just the edge there, as you can see. So again, bear that in mind there. Passenger side wing, all very good, no marks, and the same to the little arch plastic just there. Tyres on about 5mm, and again, alloy is very good, but a little bit of corrosion on there. Little mark just there, as you can see, a couple of them there, one, two, three, four. If you touch them, they're going to look a lot better, but whether you're going to paint the panel for them, that's down to you. And it's got some door protector markings on there, we're obviously been open against that, but whether you just get them done at the same time or touch them in. I don't know, everyone's different. But other than that, the rear door is all good. Uh, slight mark just on the plastic there. Again, touching will probably be fine. Um, and we'll touch on that one in a minute. Rear quarter, again, to be fair, all very good. It's also got the sunroof, all the pillars and everything are fine. Uh, rear tyre, again, is on about 5mm. And again, the alloy is very good bar. This one's got a tiny bit of corrosion. You'll have to get the bumper plastic welded, pushed it back out as you can see. Looks worse than what it is. Um, you'll have to get that knocked out and repaired and then you'll get that done at the same time. So as I touched on a couple of hundred quid, basically you need to get that done and the front wing. Door on the boot there, tiny little mark on there, that should mop and polish out. It's also got the, the plaster protector in the back. Um, on there, on the back, little tiny marks on the on the wheel cover. But again, a lot of them will a lot of them will come off. Some of them might need touching in, but nothing you're gonna certainly not gonna paint for that. Inside, it has got the full leather interior. It's just got the full leather. Smells like a non-smoker. It has also got the climate control, CD player. All the leather looks looks fine. All the door handles, all good, as you'd expect, really. And in the back, again, a little bit dirty. Needs a full valet, but you know, a couple of marks on the door handles. But you get them with them because they paint them grey, and then they obviously go back to black. But other than that, service book MOT V5 all to hand. Again, mop and polish, paint the wing in the back and the back, a little bit on the on the quarter, 250 quid maximum. But mop and polish it will really come up as a nice car. But thank you for watching and happy bidding.